Good morning, NSC Squad. Welcome back to another video. And if you're not part of the NSC Squad yet, please make sure to subscribe. So welcome to another video. Today is the today is the 14th of August. It is around quarter past seven. And I wanted to shoot this intro now because I want to take you along the journey of the three-day juice detox. So I'll be sharing how I'm feeling, the juices that I'm drinking, and also how much I actually lost in these three days. So do stay tuned with me. I hope that you enjoy this video and I hope that it also uplifts you and that you can get something from it. Let's go. So you might be wondering why a three-day detox? Yes, there's a different <laughs> lighting now because I'm in a different room now. So why a three-day detox? So basically, I want to introduce my body to the fact that we are going to start eating different. So I feel like detoxing first is going to help with appetite suppression. It's going to help with, you know, cravings and stuff like that. Obviously, it's also programming my mind that, you know what, we are eating this way. Because you know how the mind be when you have to diet. Yay, it will be going up, down, left, right, hey, craving all these things. So I feel like with the detox, you help your body, you help your mind get in tune. For, okay, this is how things will be going so that's why i decided let me do this three-day detox um juice thing and see how it actually helps me and how it actually you know how i feel how i feel because sometimes one thing that i hate about diets is that sometimes when you go on a diet you get headaches you get carbohydrate um symptoms of withdrawal there's a word for it i just forgot what they call it but you experience that you know, so yeah, so all of that just happened. So I was like, you know what, let me do a detox and then see how my body reacts to it. And if it this detox thing can actually work for me. So that's basically why I'm doing the detox. So we're going to do it Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. So today is Monday. As I mentioned earlier, it is the 14th of August. So I will be having my breakfast and lunch here at work because I am at work already and then the dinner one I'm gonna have it at home so I didn't make my own juices <laughs> I don't know how they make them but I know they they bl they blend or they use a juicer firstly I don't have a juicer but I think I can try to use a blender so I'll see with the blender one but I just bought my juices uh, my mom actually told me that Go Evergreen, they have it um, for 10 rands, which I think is not that bad. I like Food Lovers Market. That was actually like 21 rands. How crazy is Food Lovers Market? So it is the re ring gun. Is it ring gun? Ring gun? Rugani. Rugani brand. So the break for the breakfast one, I'm going to have this cloudy apple juice. I don't know why my dad actually... Yeah, okay. So I sent my dad to go buy these juices. Ne? And I told him I want vegetable juice, right? And he chose to pick an apple one. But it's fine. I feel like apple is good for the breakfast part of it. So for the breakfast part of it, I'll have the apple juice. And then for the lunch one, I'm going to have this carrot juice i've tasted it before it's not that bad honestly it doesn't taste that bad but it also doesn't taste that good <laughs> but yeah this is how it looks this is the carrot juice it doesn't taste bad but it's not the best but for a for a vegetable juice it's really not bad it really isn't so this is going to be my lunch one and then for dinner i'm going to have the green juice the green juice i've noticed that it has spinach it has cucumber so yeah that's one is going to be for my dinner so join me i hope that this can also help you and inspire you you know just to cleanse our bodies cleanse our minds you know health is wealth at the end of the day so yeah let's do this and i will also be exercising as well so i'll also add the exercising clips <laughs> i'll also add them although i i don't know why 
but I will add them. It's fine. I'll also add them just to give my video more, you know, and make it lengthier and also to just give it more context. I'll also add them. But yeah, guys, let's do the most. Let's do these. Let's do this. We can do these, right? We can do this. Let's go. to have my lunch juice the carrot juice although i'm still feeling okay but i feel a little bit of a headache <laughs> but i'm okay nothing i can't get over so lunch it is lunch will drop let's shake it up do you guys want to taste it have you ever tasted carrot juice mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> It's really not that bad. Like, nope. Yeah. Precious is like, nope. <laughs> but I feel like I love the aftertaste more than anything. The aftertaste for me, it's nice than the actual juice. So for my update right now, I just did my workout. Hey. No. Why is Hansa Bobon? No. You must open your own channel. No. It's not happening. So I am finally done with my workout. Yeah, 30 minutes. Um, update on the, my lunch and breakfast. Um, as I mentioned earlier, I did have a little bit of a headache, but that's nothing I'm not used to when I change my diet. It's just that low sugar vibe that happens on your body because at some point <laughs> I was feeling kind of, hey, cause like I was shivering a bit, but like, it's nothing that I'm not used to. I know the moment I change my diet, everything just changes in the body. It's like, you know, so 
it's something normal you get used to it as you go on but yeah that's me for day one i will see y'all tomorrow for day two cheers oh for dinner then day two vacation yes. bell is not on <sighs> I can reschedule my appointments. Yes, we're drinking juice. Nonsense. Yes, focus on one damn thing. It has cucumber, pineapple, celery, ginger, and moringa. I don't know that. Yeah, that's good. How about the moringa? Celery. Why is the rice still in the plus? Bambi. I don't want to pick this, bro. It's not bad. It's very bad. Hello NSC squad, welcome back to day two of the juice detox. So today, okay, I haven't drank my breakfast juice. I'm going to drink it just now at 8 a.m. How am I feeling today? I actually woke up feeling okay. Yesterday I did go to sleep with a bit of a headache because wow, that green juice is not it's not the one. It is terrible, terrible. Yo, 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 guys. All you can taste is the celery and the ginger. It does not taste. It doesn't taste grand. But otherwise, today I'm feeling well. I'm feeling quite energetic, you know. Maybe it's the outfit I'm wearing because I'm so relaxed today. But otherwise, I'm feeling good today. And then, yeah, we're going to head on into day two of this day's prospects. I'm going to have, I'm still deciding, what should I have carrot or apple juice as breakfast? But I think I'll just have the apple juice. Dinner, I'm going to be drinking beetroot juice. <laughs> <laughs> you guys must pray for me. I have beetroot juice, so we're going to be having beetroot tonight. Pray for me, guys. <laughs> guys, Mara, will my, will my skin glow like within these three days? Because, I mean, I get, I'm not eating, you know, greasy things. I'm drinking water. Don't you think? My skin must, you know... <laughs> I wouldn't recommend the apple juice now because it is very very sweet it's giving purity vibes for the babies you know it's very sweet and I'm trying to see if they added sugar but it doesn't say like Added sugar because you see this carrot one, yeah, no sugar added. Let me see the carrot one. What well, one here on the carrot one? It writes no. Let me put this here. It's written no sugar added. You see, preservative free, not from concentrate, no added water, all those things, but here. There is no sugar. You see? Not a preservative free, not from concentrate. Fail. It doesn't specify horwat.
inspiration is the next time I hear. Literally. I don't know. But we'll push it. Hi, NSC squad. So today is day two. As you've seen, I was busy exercising. Oh, today exercising was kind of difficult. I think because of my muscles are sore. And when your muscles are sore, it makes it difficult to exercise because when you have to do certain styles or positions, it just gets difficult. And also, I think my energy is just... <laughs> it's just quite low it's not as like yesterday where i was feeling so energetic energetic and like once we are up there today i was just uh, the mood for exercising was difficult it was difficult i just pushed myself because i know i want to exercise and i want to do it but coming here and exercising was kind of difficult. And I was still explaining that my juice for lunch time, I don't understand if I didn't have an appetite for it or it was just the taste of the juice. It literally took me like a whole hour to finish it. Literally, like it just wasn't tasting as wow as the day before. And appetite wise, I was just not having it so i just pushed myself to drink it but i also have i also had tea and then yeah man otherwise i'm still okay food wise i'm still okay honestly i'm not hungry or anything like that i just feel like you get cravings when you see other people eat like at work what happens is i sit with my other colleagues and everyone is eating and you are not eating so i feel like that's the only difficult part and also at home generalize everyone is eating and you are not eating and it's just like Ugh. but otherwise it really was it really isn't this that bad the the three day juice detox it really isn't bad i'm not hungry or anything like that it's just super well jay but there's no hunger there really isn't hunger i won't say you're gonna go hungry you're gonna go crazy no no it's really not that bad but yeah that's all of day two i'm gonna have my dinner around half the six to seven around there and then yeah we'll call it a day you know just what you do, you do to me Play my emotions like a pair of puppet strings Did it ever occur to you, my heart's more than a toy Please go easy on me, baby. Send message after message, forward my call Next day you hear me back like nothing Guys, it is... I can say 30 minutes later and I am still in this juice. Like one thing about me, I'm not a beetroot fan. So it's tough. It's tough downing down this. I thought maybe because it has carrot, it would be better. Oh, my tongue. <laughs> I thought because it has carrot, it would be better. But mm -mm, none of the above. I think the only nice juices is carrot juice. And mind you, I bought carrot juice with ginger for tomorrow's lunch. So carrot juice. And then for breakfast, I bought pineapple juice. That's what I bought. So I'm just glad that day two is finally over. And we're going into day three. And yeah, we'll be finishing off this thing. I'm proud of myself. I stuck it out. You know, it's not easy. It's never easy, but it's about the choices you want to make for yourself. And I believe in self-motivation. So before anyone else motivates me, I have to motivate myself first. So yeah, let's go. Morning, guys. It is day three and I'm so excited. I'm so, so excited. Not in a bad way, but yo, I'd like to digest something. I'd very much like to digest something in my stomach, hey? It's been a long while. It's been a long while. So it's in the morning. I'm on my way to work. And then I'm going to have my breakfast around 8 a.m. Cheers. It's me again. So I eventually got to work. This is my juices for the day. For my breakfast and lunch. So for breakfast, obviously, I'm going to have the fruit juice. It is a pineapple, queen pineapple juice, 100% let us see and it has no added sugar no added water and preservative fee 
written all right here when i do it like when i put it like this it just doesn't show but yeah anyways i showed y'all yesterday with yesterday's juice how it looks so i hope this one tastes good because guys that beetroot juice is still in the fridge someone will finish it off or we're gonna just throw it away i don't know that juice was i feel like even the green juice as much as the green juice didn't taste nice but I was able to stomach it. I was able to just like push it down my throat. Uh, pop it. Okay, it's in. It's in. <laughs> oh, very pineapple. I'm also not a big fan of pineapple okay let me explain myself so i'm not a big fan of fruits i don't like fruits like the only fruits i enjoy is mango leeches grapes sometimes strawberries are not nice guys come on unless you coat them with chocolate blueberries i also like oranges narkis that's what i can eat all these other fruits man yo ha <laughs> They just don't sit well with me. So I, I'm not a juice. I'm not a fruit person. And now as a juice, it's even worse. You can just imagine. Oh my gosh. But at least it's it's a fruit juice than beetroot juice. But it's very, very pineapple-y. Like it's very pineapple concentrated. Like there's a lot of pineapple or unwa pineapple. It's very, very pineapple-y. Hi, it is half 25 to 1, actually. And I'm having my juice today because, yo, Mulomuaga, like, it wants something. It wants something. So, and I don't think it's hunger, though, but I don't know. But knowing how this carrot juice tastes, I'm going to take long to finish it anyway. Sorry, guys, I'm just reading my emails here. So that's why I'm looking at the other direction. Okay, let's see. It's nice. It's carrot juice that I've had before, but the ginger is not that strong. It really isn't. It still tastes like the orange juice. And also it has no added sugar and no added water. Preservative free. Not from concentrate. So yeah, high in beta carotene. Carotene is the beta carotene. Okay, it's a type of carotenoid. It's what gives, oh, now I remember. I remember it from botany. So beta carotene is what gives carrots their orange color. So it's what gives things like, so carotenoids, give plants their colors so carrots sweet potatoes apricots reddish violet colors they come from beta carotene it's a pro vitamin okay that's what i meant to say it's a pro vitamin not a protein it's a pro vitamin free education right here guys but i'm feeling good this actually tastes better than the carrot juice actually that's actually nice also, if you need to buy the slimmest tea, today I actually got mine more shop right. I was even doubting it, hey? Because when I got there, I wanted to look at Close Mayor. Close Mayor, it's the brand here. I see things that Close Mayor, Close Mayor, but I'm like, where's the slimming tea? That's the green tea I want. Did I not find it like behind like cloths? Because, like, you know, sometimes go shop right, they put things like hanging in the reel. Oh my gosh, and I was so lucky to find it. So you can get it there. And also inside you get a meal plan. Let me do an unboxing of this with you. Now is that thing? Right.
so inside you have 20 tea bags right tea bags tea bag literally and then here is your meal plan close marriage seeming tea five day tea time so basically that's what they have and one thing i love about the meal plan it's so 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 sorry it is so creative it is nice there's nice snacks there is nice foods like i feel like how bore he hi nsc squad welcome back it is around seven i'll just say seven and i'm having my dinner i'm having green juice cucumber pineapple celery ginger and moringa and i personally personally i prefer this one over beetroot juice how are that beetroot juice like i literally drank it when i came back home again today i couldn't but this one i don't mind it actually isn't as bad as the beetroot so yeah this is my dinner um yeah it's the end it's the end but i'll do a closing video tomorrow updating you guys on how everything went and how i feel and etc but for now it's cheers i hope that you're having a good evening and i will see you tomorrow bye hi nsd squad welcome back to another video welcome back to another vlog um this was the 30 day juice detox and if you are new here please make sure to smash that subscribe button and be part of the nsc squad so basically in this video i took the three day juice detox challenge which was something that i wanted to do because i wanted to remind my body that you know what we need to change the way we eat we need to change the way things are going the way things are functioning just to like you know when you want to start like eating properly you need to kickstart your body so basically with the three day juice detox that's what i did i was just reminding my body man just kickstarting my body Hurry, you know what we're gonna start eating properly we're gonna start eating healthy i don't even know why it has to be considered as dieting it's not a diet and this one day i read this other quote that said the world is so used to eating junk food that when you start eating healthy they say you are dieting it's not a diet eating healthy shouldn't be like you are dieting no it's actually the right thing to do but anyways when i did this three-day juice detox it was because i wanted to just detox my body detox it from certain cravings and stuff like that so that is actually what happened like i remember with day two i think i did say that i was struggling to finish my lunch juice was it day two or day three like the juice that i had to drink for lunch like the taste of it like I, I couldn't bring it into myself. It, I found it so hard to finish it because like I was starting to lose appetite and actually I wasn't even feeling hungry or anything at, at all. So the results of the juice, with the juice, the three day juice detox, I was able to lose 3.5 kilograms. Yes, 3.5 kilograms. You heard it right here. I did lose 3.5 kilograms. Although people um, associated as being water weight, Okay, so for those of you who do not know what water weight is, I went here on Google and Googled. They say, what is water weight? The human body is composed of 60% water, which supports cellular function, regulates body temperature, transports nutrients, helps flush waste through urine urination, lubricates joints, and more. So water weight gain is the result of body storing excess water in various tissues. So basically, when you lose water weight, this means that various tissues um, that stores water in your body start to lose that water. Or basically, it's the water that you lose. That's why they call it water weight. Or you're just losing that water weight. And um, one thing that sucks about losing water weight, it's very, very easy to gain it back again right so that is why i had to after doing the three-day juice detox also start eating healthy because on to my second week i did the water weight um i did the three-day juice detox last of last week right yes so in the second week when i weighed myself again because i still ate healthy i still managed to keep it off because i still ate healthy so as much as you do follow the three-day juice detox you still have to maintain it after that that's one thing about losing weight you have to maintain it so that's what i did so 
um the upside of it yes you're gonna lose weight yes you're gonna feel lighter i do feel lighter but the downside of it is like as much as okay i didn't feel much hunger but you do have a lot of cravings and you do get headaches obviously that's from stopping to eat carbs and stopping to eat a lot of things and also you do get insomnia there was a day where i struggled to fall asleep insomnia is real yo i struggled from insomnia that was the downsides of it what else i'm trying to think about it what else did i struggle with hmm I'd also say choose juices that juice flavors. Let me say choose juice flavors that you know you will be able to handle. Like the beetroot juice that I had second night. Oh my gosh, that was just not it. It was I couldn't finish it. I literally finished it on the third day. I couldn't finish the ju the, the beetroot juice, but the green juice it also wasn't that wow, but it was manageable. I can say it's definitely manageable. The green juice it was definitely manageable. It was. It, it's it's not that tasty but it's fine the apple juice is a bit sweet it's like you eating purity like purity yabana. but otherwise it really wasn't bad i i can't fault anything it really wasn't that hectic of a diet or of a detox it really wasn't i mean it's just cravings man cravings are normal you'll crave like something spicy like i would crave wings something spicy something salty and i wasn't craving sweet things because obviously when i drank my morning juice the apple juice was very sweet the pineapple juice was very sweet but i wanted something spicy like namanya naman <laughs> that was just like the the downside of it literally but otherwise it really wasn't as hectic it wasn't as hectic as you think also something that really helped me to go to the bathroom a lot was drinking um the the green tea the slimmest green tea that one really helped me because i feel like when you just drinking the liquids for me i don't know about other people but for me it really i, I couldn't go to the bathroom and this I'm talking about number two. I couldn't go to the bathroom, but drinking the green tea, it really helped me for number two and stuff like that. But otherwise, yeah, it was manageable. It's it's not that hectic, man. You just need to keep busy during the day and exercise as well. Exercise is very important. Exercise as well. And yeah, man, just trust in yourself discipline yourself discipline tell yourself we are doing this and you will be able to do this i'm a person of self-motivation i believe that i have to self-motivate myself before i can actually do something and if you're a person of self-motivation then you have to talk to yourself look at yourself in the mirror and be like we are doing this definitely but otherwise you won't you won't you won't struggle you really won't struggle. So I hope that you enjoyed this video. I hope that it's something that you're willing to take on, willing to try if you want to shed those kilos. And yeah, good luck. If you have any questions that you would like to inquire, anything that you would like to find out, do DM me on my Instagram at Sarah underscore Nico, or you can just comment down below and I will be willing. I am more than willing to answer any questions that you guys have and anything that you would like to ask and yeah and my shout out my comment shout out goes to shalini um i believe sometimes she goes by the name of zoe she also has a youtube channel do check her out her, her content is mainly about optometry she's an aspiring optometrist and basically that's what she likes to talk about on her channel she's also someone who is tonga so she likes teaching people how to speak tonga and basically that's her channel man she's an awesome soul i love her channel but from me to you for today's video today's um it's not a vlog it's not a vlog it's a video <laughs> i hope that you enjoyed it and i hope that you do share with people that you think it can help um yeah from me to you it is love and light and i hope that you have an amazing week i'll see you on the next video cheers guys